guys doing work on the neck now. Uh, finish my laminating of the uh, pieces of mahogany and maple that I have for that. And I did finally figure out my idea, kind of template wise, of what we're going to do. So. My template is complete for my current um, body shape that I'm going to be doing for this new build on there. So you can kind of see a little bit of a single cut, a little bit of a PRS, a little bit of a telly, just combinations of all the things that I like the most. So, real time for the body. So, Oof. heavy right now. Lovely. Figured maple top on there. Send this through the planer a few times to get that thickness much more, much more down, much thinner. Neck. So just got the glue, uh, the uh, fretboard glued on there yesterday. So that's all dried now. I did go again with the uh, pre-slotted fretboard. I don't have a fretboard slotting jig. And saw I did a couple of test runs and maybe try to do it freehand myself or put a square next to it. It just didn't quite get there, and I wanted to make sure this was a, a playable instrument. So I went with the uh, pre-slotted fretboard for this one. I will eventually probably get a jig so I can start doing that myself. But I'm gonna get the multi-laminate again, the mahogany with the maple strip in the middle, and then there's the flame maple uh, fretboard there. I'm doing 25 inch scale um, for the entire. Uh, build here too. So today we're gonna put some. We'll get the neck shaped a bit, get the body shaped a bit. Uh, maybe by the end of the day I'll be able to cut my inlay, uh, have that dry overnight, so we can do some frets tomorrow.
Got a lot of progress made today. Um, got my neck mostly shaped. Um, so there's some fine, fine shaping yet to be done there and a lot of sanding uh, left to be done. Got my fretboard on there. Gonna do some um, inlay work uh, on that here in just a little bit. Um, also able to get body cut out, body shaped. Um, my channels for my neck and then the pickups also routed. Uh, I haven't done the back just yet. I'm gonna wait till I uh, carve the top. It's gonna be a carved top uh, on there. So wait until I do that, actually do the rear cavity uh, on there. Kind of trying to come up with a good idea for an inlay. I haven't quite decided exactly what I wanna do there. Hey guys, just another check in here. Uh, I've got my neck currently, as you can see, in a clamp. I'm um, gluing down the frets. Wouldn't normally clamp them. Frets are the worst part for this whole thing for me. Um, I've never been very good at getting them set perfectly uh, in there. So this time doing a little super glue, kind of flooding the channel um, and then clamping it down, making sure they set really good. And then my headstock veneer, which I have cut. I did a nice little book match. Uh, flame maple uh, for the headstock veneer on there, and so I'll set that on, drill my holes, and then I should be able to glue my neck on, so in the final stretch here.
All right, guys, here we go. Finished product. Got it uh, finished up actually just last night. So, ready to, uh, ready to take my final photos and get this thing posted. But here it is. This is the, the final build for my Great Guitar Build Off 2021. Um, like I said, kind of at the very intro, um, kind of my own body shape that I, I picked out this time. Uh, taking obviously notes from some other pretty famous body shapes out there, but kind of taking my own little twist on it. Um, dual humbucker, got Seymour Duncan humbuckers uh, in there, got 59 and a custom custom there. Hardtail wraparound bridge there. Uh, locking tuners, you can see there. Uh, I decided to go with this kind of a blue green burst uh, color on there, which I think turned out pretty good. And my uh, headstock in here that has a, a nice flame maple on there as well. Got my Trinity logo in the top. I actually was able to do a Trinity logo kind of at the back of the neck there with a branding iron, which I thought was kind of a cool thing uh, that I found online. So, um, matching control, matching uh, maple control cavity plate there. Pretty simple uh, control setup, you know, volume tone, three-way toggle uh, there. But, and then my, uh, my inlay on the maple fretboard here, you can see is a uh, um, kind of an inlay that goes all the way up, almost like a faux binding, if you will, um, on there for the inlay. But um, yeah, overall, made a few mistakes again, as one tends to do, um, but did a lot better than my previous build, a lot faster than my previous build. Um, so, really excited with the way it turned out. Um, we'll get a sound demo for you here uh, momentarily as well. But um, that is the Trinity Guitars Great Guitar Build Off 2021 final entry.